how to do a factory data reset on iPhone. This one happens to be an iPhone 15 Pro Max, but you can do it on any iPhone. But uh, you will not lose your eSIM info if you follow these instructions. And you can do a factory reset. And I'll show you how to do it. You just go to General from Set. Well, first you go to Settings, obviously, and then General. Come on. And you go down to the bottom here where it says Transfer or Reset iPhone. And then see down here it says Reset. Erase all contents and settings. And yeah, so I'm going to hit Erase all contents and settings. But see what it says? Erasing will remove your personal data. Blah, blah, blah. But you have the option. If you hit continue, don't be scared. And you put in the password. Okay, now it says keep eSIM and erase data or delete eSIM and erase data. So don't do delete eSIM if you plan on using the phone again. Because uh, then you have to contact your carrier and get the eSIM information all over again. So I'm doing keep eSIM and do a factory data reset. So the only reason I'm doing this is because I forgot to... I went through the initial settings because I had some phone calls to make. And the only way to properly transfer all your stuff from your old phone, whether it be an iPhone or an Android, is from the initial setup. The only way to get back there is doing a factory data reset, which is no big deal because I just got started with this thing. My only hesitation was the eSIM card. So now that I know that that's safe, as soon as this thing comes back up, it'll give me an option to copy all my you know, text messages and files and all that stuff from my previous phone because it's a pain in the butt to do it manually. So if you like these type of videos, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share, and have a blessed day.